Welcome guys to this new video of TechPress. Today I'm going to be showing you how to process or transfer money from your Crypto.com DeFi wallet through the actual banking account. This step-by-step -step tutorial will make it easy for you to cash out your crypto holdings. So first of all, what you want to do is to log into your Crypto.com DeFi wallet. So once you open the Crypto.com DeFi wallet application and logged in using your credentials, make sure you have the cryptocurrency you want to transfer available into your wallet. So in this case, I go directly here and home. Make sure that you have an actual total balance in order to send your money away into a banking account. Make sure, of course, that before you actually do this process, you have a little bit of money extra for uh, paying for the actual fees that needed to be paid when it comes to making the transaction. Now let's swap the crypto to fiat directly into crypto.com application. So assuming, for example, you have a little bit of money, here, what you want to do is to transfer this money and to send this into a new FIAT wallet. In this case, what I wanted to do is to use my actual crypto to choose my money and of course send this money away. So in this case, there's two ways how we can do this. Using an actual recipient address, send your amount to another crypto or to do it directly with your DeFi wallet. Now, just in case you're not able to make this process directly here into crypto, what I can tell you just do is to look out for an application, a crypto wallet that allows you to make this process directly inside your actual application. And for that, just focus inside a new tab. Let's say, for example, I go for DeFi wallet and I choose the country I'm currently living. And then it's gonna give me all the actual wallets into the country that I'm currently living so I can make this process much more faster. In my case, for example, I have Betso. So uh, Betso is gonna be helping me to receive money, make the combination, the currencies, and to make what we're not able to do here into crypto, depending on the country you're currently living. But assuming that you are able to do this into crypto, the process into doing into another wallet is exactly the same. So choose your actual token. Once you have your token, what you want to do is to sell or trade this token from the actual money that you currently have. Let's say, for example, that I chose Ether and I convert this into a currency that is available in, in, into my country. In my case, Mexican Peso. So if I choose this amount, it's going to be giving me this amount, of course, for the actual rate. So once I make this actual process, you can see that we have the exchange rate, the value, the spread, and the total to pay. Once you hit now to continue, your money should now be available here directly inside your actual Betso or into the wallet you're currently using. Exactly the same process happened with the actual uh, Crypto.com. Once you receive that amount, what you wanted to do is now to transfer the actual crypto, the fiat, now directly into your banking account. So for making the withdrawal, I go directly here inside my Betsoast, I choose my wallet, and directly into your wallet, now that I have my token with the currency that I have now available, I choose the option that says send. Once you choose the option that says send, it's going to be giving you the option to send this directly into a Betso account or to an SPay. So that means to send this money away into a banking account. So you might be seeing this load for security reasons, but this is the actual element that need to hit now to continue uh, so you can send this money away into your banking account. Usually this might be taking up to 48 hours to receive. In my case, it didn't took me more than five minutes to receive all of my transactions directly into my account. And lastly, what you wanted to do is to confirm the transfer. So after you confirm the withdrawal, you'd have to receive a notification or an email from crypto.com. So you can check the status of your withdrawal in the transaction history into the lab pod and focus directly inside your asset. Check out your asset and down here you have all the element, all the information about your transaction. Once the transfer is complete, the funds will be deposited directly into your bank account. Remember, you have to make sure that when we create an actual transaction, the status should be updated as approved or completed to see this directly into your bank account. So just in case you have any questions, just in case this asset was not working or you didn't find an actual wallet where you can just get started, what I can tell you is to contact the actualcrypto.com help center. 
So they actually have more commonly issues solved that they think to. So they can be helping us to figure out what we can do just in case we are not able to send our money uh, directly from our crypto.com or into a banking account or how to send our money away from one uh, crypto wallet into another one and receive it into your actual banking account. So that's totally of course depending on the options we're currently living. I hope guys this was a very useful video. So if you did, please give us this video a thumbs up, subscribe to TechPress for more crypto tutorials and TechPress. How many questions you need for the resistance? Once again, you can leave it below. We'd be happy to actually help you guys. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, we can all see you on a brand new section of TechPress. See you next time.